Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today's video is a little bit different because I'm going to share some Turkish baby names with you. First of all, I'm not pregnant. I know a lot of women who are pregnant make these kind of videos like uh, names I didn't use but I like or like baby names uh, inspired videos. Um, so yeah, I'm not pregnant, <laughs> but I always have loved names. Like when I watch series on Netflix or that I'm scrolling through Instagram and I see some names that I like, I have a little list in my phone that I add them to. Yes, I'm that person with baby names in their phone. Maybe it's a bit strange, but I just don't want to forget a name that I really love. And yes, I just have a little list in my phone that if I become pregnant one day, I can scroll through it and pick names that I really like. And I thought in today's video, I share some Turkish names with you. Um, if you're new here on my channel, I'm a Dutch girl and I'm living in Marmaris, Turkey. And in these five years, I heard a lot of different Turkish names. And I thought I'd just share them with you. Maybe if you're pregnant or you're looking for a Turkish name. Um, yes, I picked some out. I picked out five Five girl names and five boy names so yeah if you're excited to see this video don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and of course if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you subscribe I make a lot of beauty related videos a lifestyle vlogs so if you like that hit that subscribe button and let's get started so like I said when I hear a nice name I put it on a little list these names are not names that I would pick some of these Turkish names I really love and some a little bit less these are not like my names that I would pick for a baby these are just names that I hear a lot here so um, yes just to make that clear because I think I wouldn't really share uh, the name that I really love that maybe I would pick for my future baby so let's start with one girl name um, and this name I actually do really love and that's the name Elif Elif just sounds so sweet it's a really short name Elif really easy to pronounce in a lot of different countries and it's actually the first letter of the Arabic alphabet, if I'm right. Um, yeah, let me know in the comments down below if I say something wrong. Um, yeah, please correct me. But yes, Elif is a name that I do really love for a little girl. The only thing is that in Turkey there's a lot of girls named Elif. And that's the thing, um, if I have to pick a name for my future baby, that I like something a little bit different. And these are all names that are really common here in Turkey. And I always like a name that is a bit different. But yes, I do love Elif a lot. And I do think it's a really lovely name for a girl. So if you're pregnant with a girl, I think Elif is really cute then a boy name but this is actually a unisex name and that is Denis so Denis means sea in Turkish and like I said this is a unisex name um, I heard men called Denis but also some girls although I personally like it more for a boy Denis sounds just really powerful but also sweet like the sea so yeah I think this is such a beautiful name really a nature kind of name and I have to say that that a lot of Turkish names they all have a meaning like in English or in Dutch you wouldn't call your child sea for example or winds but yeah here in turkey that's quite common that all of the names means something so that's also what i really love about it then a really nice girl name which is Eileen. Eileen again sounds really sweet and i think it's also really easy to pronounce if you live in other country you still want to give your child a turkish name Eileen is really perfect and Eileen, and um, i know i means moon so I guess it's like moonlight maybe, Eileen. Yeah, it's something with the moon. So I think that's such a lovely name for a girl. And yeah, like I said, it's easy to pronounce, Eileen. Also really feminine, I think, girly. A really lovely name. Then a boy name that is also themed around the moon is Ilkay. Kai is quite a common name in the Netherlands. So I think Ilkay is also a really beautiful name and it means a new moon. Again, a really lovely Turkish name and I haven't heard this name quite a lot. Um, I don't know if it's very common, but I haven't met someone with this name. That's why I think it's really lovely because I haven't heard it a lot. And I really like the sound of it, Ilkay. It sounds, yeah, beautiful, I think. Then the next girl name that I think is a really special one. And you love it or you hate it, I think. But that is Bahar. Bahar is a bit more difficult to pronounce, I guess, if you're from another country. 
um, but in Turkish it means you have sonbahar and ilkbahar and that is like spring and fall so it's again a nature kind of name I've met a few people named Bahar and I just, I don't know, I really like the sound of it because it's a bit different Bahar and I just love spring and the fall and yeah, I think it's a really beautiful name but definitely a bit different if you are not used to Turkish names but I think it's very beautiful. Then a Turkish name that I hear a lot now. So it's quite a popular name here in Turkey. And that is the boy named Mert. Mert sounds quite harsh. It's not a name I think that I personally would pick. Because one, it's really popular. And two, I don't really love the sound of it. But I wanted to share it with you. Because I hear it a lot. And of course it's a really easy name to pronounce. Mert. Quite short and also powerful I guess. And I think it means courage. I'm not really sure. Let me know in the comments down below if you know it. But I believe it's mean courage. But I've met several little boys called Mert. So yeah, it's a quite popular name now uh, here in Turkey. Then another girl name that I really like is Damla. And Damla means drop of water. And Damla just sounds really sweet to me. And my sister-in-law is called Damla. And yeah, I think it's a really sweet girly name. Damla, just like really... I don't know, if you think about Damla like a little girl, it's just yeah, a really cute little name, I think. And you can't imagine to call your child in English like drop, like drop of water, like it's kind of funny. But yeah, in Turkey, like I said, it's all have a meaning. So yeah, Damla is just a really nice name. Then another uh, popular boy name is Kuze. And I believe there was like a TV series, Kuze Gune, and Kuze means North, I believe. And I believe Kim Kardashian's child is also called North. But yeah, usually you don't hear it, of course, in the English language. But like I said, Kuze is another quite popular uh, boy name. It's not really a traditional name, I believe. It's more of a newer name. Um, but yes, if you have a little boy, I think Kuze is a really lovely name. Then the last girl name that you hear also quite a lot now is Mira. Mira is, I believe, not like a typical Turkish name. I believe it's more like Bosnian or something, Macedonian maybe. But Mira you hear quite a lot now. And I can see why. It's a really sweet name. Again, quite short Mira with an A on the end. And yeah, that makes it really feminine and girly, I think. And I really love that name, just a little girl Mira. It's just a really beautiful name, I think. And then the last boy name that you hear quite a lot and that is a more typical Turkish name, I would say, is John. John is a really popular name and I think it's also a really like old-fashioned Turkish name. It's again quite short, so easy to pronounce, I think. And I'm not really sure what John means, but I googled it and it said man with soul. Um, but yes, there was again a TV series, John Polat, and that's quite popular, so I think that's why maybe the name is a bit more common again. And a lot of Turkish people, they give their children two names, so like I said, like John Polat, or like Elif Aylin, like... It's really popular now to give your child uh, two names here in Turkey. And yes, let me know if you like to see more of these name videos. There are so much more names here. Maybe I can make some videos like nature inspired or like popular Turkish names. Yeah, let me know. I would really like to make uh, some more videos about this topic because I just really love it. And let me know what is your favorite Turkish name. And if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. I upload some twice a week every Wednesday and Saturday and of course you can also follow me on Instagram and I hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos bye